hello ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another video on my channel now a few people are facing stuttering issue with battlefield 5 so an ios and this is very annoying for a game although battlefield 5 was supposed to be a very very optimized game according to ea now this is just a beta and we're facing lots of issues and hopefully we will face more issues in the real game e now I'm going to show you how to fix this stuttering issue and get a playable FPS plus smooth gameplay. So without a further ado, let's jump into it. So first of all, you have to open up NVIDIA control panel. There, you'll have to go to program settings. Now in program settings, you have to select Battlefield 5. If you do not see Battlefield 5, go to add button and then select your game. Once you have done that, use all the settings I did. And then after that, you have to click on the apply button. Okie dokie, we're done with the program settings. Now we have to open up our game. Once the game is opened, go to more, option, game settings. And there, scroll down to minimap. And then set the texture opacity to zero. Now go to video settings. There in the basic tab, you'll see a lot of special game settings such as weapon off, film drain, banyard and you can turn them off to get more improvement in the gameplay FPS. Also, you can turn off the motion blur, which I forgot to show you in the video. Moving on to the advanced tab, you'll see an option called frame limiter. In here, you'll have to set it to monitor refresh rate. Otherwise, if it's more than your monitor can show, it will actually cause a little bit of stuttering. Now we have GPU memory restriction. If your GPU has more than 4 GB or maybe even more, you can actually turn it off. But if your GPU has less than that, you have to turn it on. Now let's go to graphics quality. Here, to get the best out of your game, be sure to do the settings like I did. Now you can actually turn the vertical synchronization off if you want to, but if you do prefer it, you can turn it on, which I forgot to show you in the video. And also don't forget to set your match quality to high, because if you set it to high, you can see the enemies from far away. Now these are the settings you can try. But I do recommend you to use dual 8 GB, meaning 16 GB, because if you have about uh, only single 8 GB, that's not gonna be good for you at all, especially not for playing this game because it's gonna shatter a lot. But if you have two 4 GB, that will be really good, but you'll still have a little bit of micro stuttering, which is why I recommend you to use dual 8 GB, 16 GB, which is better for you and it's gonna be really, really good for you. Now if you have dual 4 GB which means 8 GB, you'll have to do this because only 8 GB is not enough. So what you have to do is make a page file. And how you're gonna do is you're gonna have to go to your file manager, right click on your this PC, go to properties, and then you're gonna have to go to advanced system settings. There you're gonna have to go to advanced, go to performance settings, and then advanced. And here uh, just select the uh, change button just like this and select your C drive there you're gonna have to set it to 1600 uh, I mean 16 GB but if your uh, space is a bit lower then you can set it to 8 GB but for me I'm just gonna select 16 GB so that's all for now I hope you guys like this video and hope that it worked for you a lot and I'll see you guys in the next one